One thing I'd always talked about doing after I got my sleeve gastrectomy was once I lost my weight, I wanted to do some hiking and camping. So I'm preparing to go on an overnight camping trip and hiking with my family tomorrow. Um, one thing that I wasn't quite sure how to handle was the food situation because I have to eat so much protein. I didn't really know how many options there were for me and what I could actually pack in and carry and, and what things I should have. Um, now that I'm about nine months out from my surgery, I'm a little more relaxed on the things I'm allowing myself to have. I've hit my surgeon's goal of having me under 200 pounds. So I'm adding some things back into my diet and just seeing how some things work and for me and some things don't. So some of the things that you're gonna see that I'm taking with me aren't necessarily things that someone who just had the surgery would be eating, but they are things that I've slowly added a little bit into my diet. And I figure with the miles that we're gonna be hiking at the altitude we are and the work I'm gonna be putting in, that I'll be burning those calories and I'll be needing those carbohydrates. I'll be needing all of that energy. So I'm gonna give you a peek at what I'm taking with me. Now, the first thing that I thought of and what I figured would probably be the easiest was to take some protein bars. I personally like the Quest bars. Um, so I grabbed a few of them, one of each flavor out of my pantry and I'll be taking those with me. Those will be kind of an easy thing to do. Um, the other thing that has been a staple throughout this whole process is beef jerky. So I got some high quality beef jerky and I sealed up a couple packages of it that I can at least tear one open and I can snack on it throughout the day for the first day and I can tear the other one open and snack on it throughout the day for the second day. Now the next two items some people might balk at. However, you need to work with your nutritionist and your surgeon to see what it is that that you're allowed to have and as you're working things back into your diet you'll start having more of these things and that is trail mix. So I've got a couple ounces of trail mix, one for each day that I sealed up. Like I said it before, I figure with the work that we're going to be doing and the, the miles we're hiking that putting in a little bit extra calories and fat probably won't be a bad thing and my body will need it. Now this is something that I just recently added in as my nutritionist said as long as it's whole grain that she was alright with me having a little bit of it and that is some wheat thins. So I've added in 10 whole grain wheat thins to take with me. And that's really just if I want a snack, if I feel like I'm wanting something crunchy that that is um, potato chip-like, that it's something that I can have that my nutritionist okayed for me. And I've actually found that so far, I haven't had any issues with them. They haven't caused me to slow down my weight loss. Like I said, I'm, I'm at my goal. So I'm really just trying to maintain now. And uh, they're not causing me to gain. I'm not having a whole lot of them, but 10 of them, I think that'll be plenty. To go with those crackers, I'm also bringing a package of tuna fish that I may or may not eat. These things are great. I like the portion sizes. I keep them in my bag that I take to work. If I ever run out of, run out of good options for what I can eat and I'm looking for something quick and easy, I can always pull one of these out. And as you can see, the nutrition on them is great. So for the next two days, that's that's going to be my food, and I'll uh, I'll let you know how that works out for me. All right, let's go get this bag packed.
trip was an absolute blast. So I had just enough food on me to get through the entire trip and have a little bit left to snack on on the way home. Uh, now the stuff that the weight loss surgery folks are wondering about. Uh, two days ago, the morning that we left, I weighed in at 198. I was able to eat that food, do the hike, got back yesterday a little bit after noon, had my normal lunch, had a regular dinner with my wife, and this morning I was 197 and a half. So I lost a little bit of weight through the process. I kind of expected that, but I was able to eat those things, snack throughout the entire trip, and, and be satisfied.